Good morning. I would like to show everyone today how to draw the Milky Way. So, what you want to do is um, have a dark purple like this. And then you want to have it up to a hundred brush size and 100 and then you just do that paint it all in and then next what you have to do we go to medium nozzle go to white and then bring it down a little bit like this to 33. And the 21 or 22. Then what you want to do is do it really, really lightly. And then here comes the Milky Way. There's the Milky Way, so sometimes the Milky Way has different colors, like dark blues and stuff like that, but like add some blue into it. And it makes those colors pop. Then add some pinks in there. I don't, I don't want to put too much color into this because it will make it like it, it would get too much. So there it is. So now that you're done with the Milky Way, what I want to do is add some trees. So. And since this is night time, what you want to do is put it to black and then turn like a hundred percent brush opacity and a number eleven brush size. And then you make the ground like this. You can make the ground any way you like because the earth has so many different shapes and so that's the ground. Maybe instead of trees, I'll do mountains instead. So mountains, make it a little bigger, brush size to 20. And then what you want to do is go up and down like this, like a triangle. And then there's your mountains. And sometimes this gives a really good effect. This one is called nebula and then maybe a 38 on opacity and a brush size 13 and then really really lightly that gives oops wrong color. I meant to put it to black there we go And that just gives it that nighttime sky effect. And with the mountains, sometimes there's a sun, and uh, not sun, a moon shining. 
So brush size 8 and opacity 71. See if that does it. And then what you want to do is do a little dot. Oh, let's change it to white. Might work better. There you go. And then there's your moon. If you want to have it a little lighter, like dimmer, you need to turn the opacity down. So let's try let's try 40. I I actually like it like that better because sometimes the moon is faint like that, like not very bright. Or sometimes the clouds go in front of it. And then the sun, I mean the moon, it's called a flare. And then if you want to get like those stars in, you go into touch-ups and go to noise brush. Okay, brush size 100 and opacity 25. What you do is really, really lightly. And here comes all those stars. There's billions of stars out there. There you go. And another, and another thing what you could do is give the mountains a little touch-up, like give them a little glow of the moon glowing onto them, like this. But you don't want to have it too bright, because... There you go. So I hope you guys liked this video about drawing the Milky Way with the mountains and and then um, subscribe to my channel and there'll be lots more drawing drawing uh, tutorials on on the way so thanks for watching stay creative